on Maggie's channel, Ask and You Shall Receive. This is Man of Constant Sorrow, low bass singer cover by Jeff Castellucci. Y'all, the first time I ever heard Man of Constant Sorrow was with Home Free, and now we've got Jeff doing it, and I'm literally so excited I could literally die. I cannot wait to see this. It's going to be insane. He's doing this kind of a four-person Jeff effect again, and it's going to be epical. I am so ready to do this. Thank you guys so much for recommending this video to me. Guys, let me know what you like and what you don't like. And let me know if there's anything else we need to know. And comment what I should react to next. Here we go. Man of constant sorrow. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, Jeff. Let's. Oh my God. I'm just so excited. I'm excited. Okay, let's do it. In constant sorrow all through this day. Constant sorrow. Well, I've seen trouble all my days. I bid farewell to old Kentucky, the place where I was born and raised. Okay, wait. Before we continue on, can we just talk about the way that he said, I am a man? Like that low bass voice for that line excuse me jeff you can't do something like that to us you can't you can't i mean you did but you can't okay In constant sorrow, all through this day. that's a really cool intro i am a man of constant sorrow well i've seen trouble all my days i bid farewell Kentucky, the place where I was born and raised. The place where he Ooh. was born and raised. What was that? Raised. Piano, I need your help. Oh my goodness gracious. It is an E1. He was born and raised. Woo! We love a good E1. Oh my gosh. Careful. Okay, this. Yeah, four, six long. Oh my gosh. Literally, like, just yes. Absolutely yes. Yes. I love that sound in the bass voice. I will say, I have to be honest, I love his low notes so very, very much. He's kind of going into this pattern. I've noticed this in the last few videos that he's done of this, like, not nasal singing, per, like, per se, but it's kind of this poppier sound that's kind of like a, mm, I don't know exactly how, let me, let me show you what I'm talking about so you can see what I mean. Hail to old Kentucky. To old Kentucky. It's kind of like almost... I hate to say this like this because I love Jeff singing. I really do. And I admire all of the amazing talent that he has. He just does this kind of like nagging kind of a sound almost where he goes into his nasal just a little bit like too much for my taste. And it sounds like he's trying to strive for a poppier sound, but it's coming out as like a naggy thing versus his rich lush sound that he has on the bottom. So I'm kind of, I don't know. I, I don't know if he watches these reactions, but it would be really cool for him to bring out that lush and rich sound in his voice and not fall too far into that nasal, like kind of like, Mm -mm, kind of a sound versus the ah, uh, keeping that soft palate up and leaving it in that rich place. I bid farewell to old Kentucky, the place where I was born and raised. See, like the born and raised is so rich, but then like the place where I was kind of. Mm. I bid farewell to old Kentucky, the place where I. See, like the place where. I, and so the place where I it's like missing that corn that richness of his sound versus I was born and raised then it suddenly goes the in you know was born and oh my gosh that E1 is glorious he's so talented yeah, four six long years I'm there no pleasures here on earth I've found For in this world I'm bound to ramble Yeah, I just want to bring it up one more time because it's really important that he gets that. And I don't know if any of his followers want to like 
I let him know or whatever it is, or if he'll see this, but just this like this nasality can really leave the sound because he's got such a glorious, rich voice that when he goes into that nasal place to try and make it a little bit brighter, it's not working for his voice type. Four, six long years, I've been in trouble. No pleasure. See, like, I've been in trouble. It sounds like he's doing that instead of, I've been in trouble, trouble. He needs to open up his throat a little bit. It's just like a weird thing that I'm hearing, and I feel like that richness in his voice and getting that all the way through his voice consistently from bottom to top will make it that much better and just people will die literally they will die because he's got such a glorious instrument that i feel like if he implements that in his technique it'll just be unstoppable Long years i've been in trouble no pleasures here on earth i've found For in this world i'm bound to ramble i have no friends Love those growls. Ooh, nice arrangement. Yeah. Nice. Oh, I've been traveling down this road And how my soul is gonna stray I can feel it like a bullet No matter where I tread All my days I have been running From these ghosts within my head yeah. You can nice bury run. me In some deep valley For many years where I'm laying there another e1 oh, oh my gosh those e1s are like glorious little needles in a haystack that are like what in the world but then when you find the needle it's like a masterpiece <laughs> i don't even know those notes are just stunning only he has those oh. For many years where i'm laying i love this arrangement he does such a great job arranging songs My face you'll never see no more Nice production There is one promise that is given Will I meet you on God's golden shore Gosh, and that video footage is absolutely stunning. Good for them. Good for him. <laughs> no audio. <laughs> That's awesome. Hey, y'all. Thanks for watching. I should mention that the train tracks I was walking down were not in use. So please, please, please don't go walking down any train tracks near you. Trains are big and strong, and you are soft and squishy. Yes, Special yes, thanks I am to very my squat, soft and squishy. But especially Haldra Draco, Christy Jones, Sarah O, Laura Mueller, Patricia Schumann, Debbie Goodling, Emily Zabst, Carl and Melanie Thomas, Osa M. Lagnestall, and Dorothy Brune. Thanks again. I'll see you all soon. I am definitely soft and squishy. Thanks, Jeff. He has no friends to help him now. Okay, so the arrangement is awesome. The um, kind of harmonies that he created, 
epical. Really love that. Um, like I said, I think the only thing that I have to say that I wish he would kind of just improve a little bit on is honestly his solo vocal. I don't know if it's the way that he's producing. I mean, he definitely just has to sing it a little bit differently than he's doing it. Like the technique that he's using isn't isn't allowing his best sounding voice to come out. Like he's got so much more in that than he's giving on those higher notes because I think he was singing in a you know in a vocal group I have to say that I think that's the reason because when you're singing with a group you have to blend your vocals to theirs and he's the lowest voice and obviously the higher vocals are always going to be a little bit more high and a little bit placed differently than his bass vocals and so he's gotten used to singing that which is great for his harmonies and his background vocals in the video like he always sounds those background vocals and the harmonies that he does are always incredible they're always tuned they're always really on top of it but then his solo kind of falls short a little bit except for in the lower part in the lower part of his voice he's always like a hundred percent on it sounds phenomenal in tune rich just like everything you would want from it and then in the higher he just goes into that nasal quality just a bit too much for these kinds of songs like if he was doing a bubblegum pop song i'd understand but he's got more talent and more ability and more richness like that that's the thing if you have an instrument like that you have to use it to its full potential and i feel like he can do more with that and so i really hope that he'll kind of consider Th listening to himself maybe I don't know like I don't want to be rude because he's d such a great musician and he's doing such great things but he may want to talk to like a vocal coach or get somebody he trusts to listen to him and kind of you know ask about that kind of a thing or or listen back to himself and judge it that way you know what I mean there's a way to produce his vocals differently and the reason I say that is because even I'm learning to produce my vocals differently as an opera singer trying to sing in different genres pop rock blues R&B jazz all these things I have to adjust my vocalism depending on what genre I'm in and it changes dramatically and that's the same thing with him and his um, group vocal work and his solo vocal work and he's only going into the solo stuff like as of a few a couple years ago from what I've seen so I think if he go really goes into that and works on his vocal quality his his vocal tone it'll be whoop, it'll be tremendously incredible like people will be blown away by the strength and the beauty of his voice because right now he's kind of singing like a background singer in his solo work i think if that makes sense and i don't mean to be harsh but i've also seen other commenters on his videos being like that was good but like it's it, there's, there's that one thing that's like an interesting kind of a, a thing and i figured that i would mention it so that hopefully somebody will let him know or hopefully he can see it or something like that but jeff you're amazing and i'm not trying to criticize you at all even though i'm saying my opinion as an opera singer it's just like what i'm hearing and i just know you can do so amazingly well in anything that you sing so Anyway, ramble over. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and thank you so much for recommending this video. That was so much fun to see. Let me know when the next one comes out so I can see it as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment down below what I should react to next. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see another one of my reactions to this artist or group, please don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and comment down below what video I should watch next. Also, be sure to join us on Twitch for our weekly live streams of music, reactions, and more. Don't forget to check out the links down below in my description for exclusive behind the scenes perks and benefits. I am sending you all so, 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 so much love, and I will see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.